been getting a lot of sleep so far on this trip. I'd have woke you, but you look so peaceful with your face in the sand. If you're worried about the ship, you can stop worrying. It's wrecked right over there. So far, it's just you and me and the chair lady over there. It's a relief to see you awake, my lord. I worried you were in for another long sleep. Don't know, but it's real pretty. Difficult to say for certain. The dead fire is spotted with islands, some quite small. The good news is that if the storm hasn't spun us round entirely, I'd say we're in charted waters. I believe the Valian Trading Company operates in the region. Hence that little visit from that wretched pirate captain. I'm afraid I won't be much assistance in that regard. And not to doubt Master Adair's capacity, but even he would need supplies. That's true. Steak, especially. Patching the hull is only the start. You're going to need help getting the Defiant out to sea again. And a crew, for that matter. Let's see about the other survivors. And somehow we gotta get the ship repaired. I don't want to be paddling out of here on a salvage raft. For now, I'd say your best bet is to find some sign of civilization. If nothing else, we may be able to hire on a shipwright. My lord, if it is not too taxing, could you explain how it came to pass that you were returned to us? These gods. You make one deal with them to stop a madman, and the next thing you know, they're threatening your soul. That isn't much of a choice, but castle or no castle, you are still my lord, and I will aid you to the best of my ability. Well, I suppose we better get a move on. So many souls lost. Surely someone else survived. Hope the rest of those sodden bastards made it. I've got it. <laughs> 